Hello, happy summer. Today is our first day of summer break and Kaylin and I want to do a project. We want to rehab this hideously ugly looking rug. Okay, step one of our ugly rug rehab, Kaylin is brushing off dirt and dust and the yucky. This is our ugly rug. Next step, we're going to paint it white. All right, there's Kayla. We have prepped the rug. <laughs> well, you know, we just dusted it. All right, she's dipping into the white paint, and we are going to begin our project. Uh, oh, it already looks better, Kaylin. Yep. We've got it stretched out and covered already. We think it looks 100% better anyway. So we're going to let it dry and then we'll see where we need to add a little bit of paint. And we're going to use some paint we already have. The Paul's paint was ugly. So we're going to make a trip to Walmart and pick up a little bit more paint so we can have it covered. We did left up our paint. Okay, next step, let it dry. Our rug is now some shade of white and it's going to dry. We're going to combat and get some paint. We'll come back and we'll put our design. We can't bring the design. Well, today is the day we finish. I kept thinking, and Kaylin and I were talking about the color choices, and I think this pink right here. I think it should have been brown to tie in with those, so got my brown out and gonna redo it. Stay tuned. All right, I left it half and half so you can see the brown and the pink, and I think I'm gonna be okay with that brown. We're going with uh, or attempted to go with some sort of 70s color scheme, and I think we missed the mark, um, but still, I like it anyway. I think it's more of an art deco look than a 70s. But anyway, I think we're going to be pleased with it. But that's the difference in the brown and the pink. And I'll finish up with the brown and then we'll start filling in the blocks. Well, here is the finished product. We are done. Put a fork in us. We're done. Kaylin loves it. And I think we missed the 70s theme, 70s style slightly. But that's okay. We like it. We're content. And I guess if we had it all to do again, Kaylin and I thought that maybe we should have painted the bottom brown instead of white. Just because of our style that we were doing. Um, oh, Kaylin, get those little brush that you just rinsed. We found something really handy, something that we learned along the way. These little brushes, they're little stoppers. Yeah. Like these. We had them in our art box. I think I got them at Walmart, maybe. Anyway, they were really good. We also figured out that if you pour the paint on the rug, it helps. It kind of makes it cover better. There's spots that aren't perfect, but that's okay. It's ours. It was a fun project, and it didn't take us very long. I hope that if you have an old rug around that's ugly, just turn it over. Because this side is so much better Ugh, that's what it looked like on the other side. Rancid. And now we have a beautiful rug. I wouldn't crawl on it if I were a baby. It might make your knees rough, but it sure is going to be pretty. Thanks for watching. I hope you get to try one.